Finally, this year's Nobel Peace Prize awarded to an Iranian activist repeatedly jailed for her human rights work. Andrea Mitchell now with her defiant message. Tonight, the Nobel Peace Prize shining worldwide attention on longtime activist Nargis Mohammadi for fighting against the oppression of Iranian women. Her brave struggle has come with tremendous personal cost. Currently in prison, Mohammadi releasing a statement that the Nobel Peace Prize will make her more resilient and determined. President Biden in a statement celebrating Mohammadi's remarkable courage, adding, she has endured repeated arrests, persecution and torture. <laughs> Mohammadi has been a leading voice in the unprecedented protest sparked by the death last year of Masa Amini, arrested for not fully covering her hair. What effect do you think this could have on the regime and on the crackdown against the women protesters? It's crucial that the international community stands in solidarity, solidarity with the Iranian people. And this is extremely symbolic. And hopefully it helps us highlight the Iranian people's aspiration for a secular democracy. With Lester in Tehran last month, Iran's President Raisi blamed the protests on the U.S. and others. Some European countries and the U.S. US were making use of this incident as a project against the Islamic Republic of Iran. Just this week, 16-year-old Armida Gerevan was hospitalized. Human rights groups say she's in a coma after being attacked on a subway by Iran's police for leaving her hair uncovered. Fresh evidence for why Nargis Mohammadi has made fighting for human rights her life's work. Andrea Mitchell, NBC News, Washington. Thanks for watching. Stay updated about breaking news and top stories on the NBC News app or follow us on social media.